The 34th annual Baton Memorial Death March Marathon takes place on Sunday. This will be the first time that it will be back in person since the start of the COVID-19 pandemic. ABC 7's Jared Ortega spoke with a Fort Bliss infantry soldier who is excited to participate in the race for the first time. He joins us now from our New Mexico mobile newsroom. The event, which honors the memory of those lost in the World War II Baton Death March, is drawing participants from all over the world for the first time back since COVID-19. Among those taking part in the race for the first time is Staff Sergeant Richard Ledesma, a member of the 16th Infantry Battalion stationed at Fort Bliss. I've been trying to do this one for a while, but I've been overseas most of my career, and now that I'm in Texas, it's the best time to do it. Ledesma tells me he's honored to be able to participate in an event that pays tribute to the brave soldiers who endured the grueling march over 80 years ago. So I've been training for the past three months, every day rucking to work and back and no, I think I'm ready. Ledesma is challenging others to join him for the race and says he's putting something special in his pack to help him get through the race. It's a tradition I do. I always carry a, a six pack of beer uh, because I need to make the weight. I'm putting two six packs, so a 12 pack of beer in there. You know, there's going to be a lot of military there as well. And uh, why not enjoy it also with them and share the beer out too. <laughs> If you'd like to participate in the marathon, there's still time to sign up. For more information, head to batonmarch.com. In Las Cruces with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom, Jared Ortega, ABC7.